Good morning, friends. Welcome back to She's in Her Apron. It is Monday. <laughs> it feels like a Monday. All right, and the kids just ate breakfast. They're finishing getting dressed. Um, my day got mixed up from what it was supposed to be. Um, I After I dropped the kids off to school, I was supposed to get a massage. But Derek's car, we forgot over the weekend, wasn't doing well. Like, it started shaking when it go over 40 miles an hour. And uh, so yesterday, Sunday, we did the family thing. And we totally, like, forgot about the car. So I had to cancel and reschedule my massage. Because um, I'm going to take him into work after I drop him, drop the kids off at school. So it's one of those Monday mornings where you just got to roll with, with what's coming to you. One of the things I want to do this, um, well, today, is to make and freeze some sandwiches for the kids because it makes packing school lunches so much easier. You can go to the freezer, grab a sandwich, put it in their bag in the morning, and buy lunch. It's like thawed out. It's great. Um, I do notice that if you do ham and cheese sandwiches, if you slice them down the middle, um, instead of making them a whole sandwich, they thaw out faster. It's time to make some sandwiches. Hey friends, I am now in Bed Bath & Beyond because we got curtains for our home. We sure did. And Derek got our curtain rods here and they look really good. He just forgot the um, when you swing back your curtains, the hooks that you can hook them on. And so I need to find where they are. And then guess who's meeting me here? Do you guys remember Heather, my good friend from back home? She's meeting me here because she doesn't live far from here. So, and then while I'm here, I'm trying to find a really cute gift for my friend Katie. Yesterday was her birthday, and I didn't see her Sunday yesterday because we didn't go to our church. We went to the MTC for church, and the MTC is the Missionary Training Center. It's where all the missionaries for our church go. Um, there's missionary training centers around the world. There's a few, but the one in Provo is the big one, and we um, went there for church because Derek's parents are... Well, his dad is a branch president. And so we went there and we had sacrament meeting there and we got to be with the missionaries and it was really cool. Derek got to talk to the missionaries and give some uh, advice. It was wonderful. And so, all right, so my battery is about to die so I want to save it so when we find Heather, so. Come on, Heather. Ta-da! Good morning, YouTube! <laughs> For all of you that are new, this is Heather. Hello. I'll link. <laughs> The videos below where we talk about how we met as kids. It's quite pretty disturbing. funny. Yeah. <laughs> I was her bully. I know. I repented. I still die. She loves me now. I know. I <laughs> and I so love her mean. now. I love I her. love her. So she met me here at Bed Bath & Beyond. And I was like, I never come up this way. So I was like, <laughs> Heather, I'm in town. Come see me. I like rushed out. Bedhead, I still have my jammy shirt on. Don't judge me, people. <laughs> <laughs> I love her. So yeah. We had to see my girl. So this is Heather. Hi, and you I know too. a lot of you know her and absolutely adore her. And, Hi, everybody. And of course you should. <laughs> <laughs> Why wouldn't you? I mean, really, I'm pretty awesome. We were talking about how, like, we're old because things excite us like curtains and... Mm -hmm. Yeah, we were like, like, Bed Bath & Beyond, yay! <laughs> I know. We're like, we're old. Yeah. 
We should be talking about going out and I boys. Boys. <laughs> <laughs> nope, we changed, yeah. girl. <laughs> yeah, we have. We're all. Mm, it's okay. We're turning 40 this year. <gasps> That's all right. No, we're gonna. Forty never looked so good though. Oh yeah. Oh, she's so sweet. Yeah. <laughs> Well, uh, just finished getting my nails done, and, um, well, after I left Heather, I went to Hobby Lobby. Yeah. <laughs> I bought a few things for the home. I'm just working on the living room and the kitchen. I uh, just bought a couple of things, because after we, we haven't really decorated this house, you guys, and with painting the cupboards in the house, nothing matches, and so I got a couple of things, and I won't be buying any more decorations for the home or... Or working on anything until uh, in a couple of months um, we're going to spruce up our bedroom the master bedroom so that is all the shopping I'm doing for a while so um, but I went and got my nails done after that and that was fun it's always fun to see Camille and get my nails done um, and now Boston is at tutoring I haven't been home all day <laughs> it's just one of those days but um, I was catching up on social media and on YouTube and my heart is um, breaking for people that I know. Um, a friend miscarried and that is heartbreaking and my heart goes out to her. And my heart goes out, if you guys follow Mom's Vlog 80, their son Elijah just passed away last night from battling cancer. Oh, I've been following their journey and it... I'm so sad for them. Um, I can't imagine. I can't imagine what they're feeling and what it's like to lose a child. And so I am. My heart goes out to them, and my heart goes out to to you, Melody, as a mom, and Ronnie as a dad. I just, my heart goes out to you guys, and uh, I pray that you guys find comfort and um, peace with this. We the Hughes send our love to you guys. Lots of love and hugs. I'm gonna hug my babies when they get home. They're gonna be so annoyed with me, like, ma, stop it. <laughs> I'll be like, I don't care. You come here, I'm holding you. <laughs> I got some stuff at Bed Bath and Beyond when I was there. I got the hooks to the curtains, um, but I picked up a birthday gift for my friend Katie. Yesterday was her birthday. And like I said, I didn't get to see her. Yesterday we were at the MTC, um, but I got her a gift. Uh, something that will comfort her and um, yeah her and her husband are uh, going through something right now which totally sucks and it's irritating that they have to go through it um, and so I got them I got her a little something to cheer her up and comfort her it's this beautiful throw um, it's so pretty Can you, oh it's so pretty very pretty and so I got that for her with a head massager and use have you guys used these head massagers oh it feels so good so she can relax and and enjoy that and just fade away because uh, when I get home I need to cook dinner and then um, get ready for family home evening family home evening we call it FHE family home evening it's like having a devotional once a week with the family um, we do activities we have a little mini lesson we read scriptures and tonight we're gonna teach the kids how to slay the dragons how to slay their dragons so basically what it is is anything they're frustrated with during the day um, or mad about or sad about or worried about or afraid about uh, we're gonna teach them how to write it out and then destroy the paper and get all that energy, negative energy and thoughts and feelings out. Because when it's built up in them, whoo boy, people get cranky and yell and fight. So we're going to teach them how to slay their dragons. And this is what I do every day. I do this every day. So, uh, and Derek's been doing it too. And it's been really good. It's been really good for me and my anxiety, you guys, actually. So we're gonna teach the kids how to slay the dragons, how to slay their dragons that are in them and get them out and 
and and be able to move on with life so and we're gonna bake some cookies Boston's in charge of a treat and he's gonna help me bake the cookies uh, yesterday we had family council and what family council is is where we get together we sit and see how school's going how are things going things in the home so we went over zones again with them and what is to be expected when they do clean in their zones and uh, so we went over that and uh, yeah so we did that for family council and tonight we're doing family only winning cookies and slaying dragons that's what we're doing so it's gonna be crazy I haven't been home all day, but uh, the kids did great on their zones last night, so the house isn't too bad, so that's nice. So, yeah. And when we get home, I should have a delivery on my doorstep. I'm excited to show it to you, so stay tuned. And when I go home and Derek puts up the curtain, like, hook rods, I'll show you the curtains. Because I know you guys noticed it in the Motivational Monday vlog. You noticed the curtains. They're so pretty. They bring me joy. Hmm life now things that bring me joy curtains <laughs> oh well it's beautiful and I can't wait to show you so let's t grab Boston and head home okay I'm working on dinner and I have three tuna pot pies getting ready to go in the oven I'm just putting the lids on them uh, so dinner is almost there Boston and I uh, made some cookies um, we had some leftover like holiday morsels um, and so we are making cookies for dessert tonight. So that is what's going on. Oh, and I'm watching Gilmore Girls while doing it. <laughs> All right, so I have my uh, oven preheated 420 degrees, so I'm gonna get these in and then clean up my lovely mess. Lovely. I haven't told them what our special delivery is, but it's not coming today. Mm. It'll be here Wednesday. <laughs> We're really bummed about it. Derek was like ready to build what is coming and we're bummed. So dinner is done. We're just letting it cool off and if you let it sit for a little while the inside won't get like all like liquidy. It'll set up and it'll stay thick for you. So that is happening. I have some cookies ready to go in the oven. Tonight for dinner, I made tuna pot pie. The first pie that we cut open always is a little more runnier than the other two that are sitting there. But my kids don't want to wait anymore. They are hungry. The two older kids always start off with two pieces. They love it. And so instead of a salad tonight, because I'm going to do a seven layer salad um, tomorrow night, uh, we are having green beans that are seasoned with garlic salt. 
that is our dinner tonight. Mm. We have it tuna pot pie, green beans, yum.